Hello. Is that Hello. Captain Tommy and John, brother John, going to pick up our boat. Well, we're going to do a survey on it, and we're going to do a sea trial. It's supposed to take five hours for the sea trial, and uh, possibly get a dinghy. We're going to bring y'all along with us. We're taking it one step at a time, but we are heading from Lake Charles, Louisiana to Tampa, Florida. Come along with us. Bye. This is, the, this is the cockpit area, the shower, and you walk into the back door, and you're in a big living room area. There's a, a, a um, head with a vanity mirror, closet. This is all the big area. There's a glass in area where you go down. I've got videos of it going down. And here's the living room, the kitchen, Mr. John's at the bar. And take measures in your bunk bag. Yep. Is this sure is here with this? Okay, there's the countertops that I'm gonna be replacing. That's mine, yes. There's a uh, trash compactor that's gonna be an ice maker one day if I get the boat. And there's a little um, can opener. A little sign says galley. All right, and this is like a little bar area, lots and lots and lots of uh, storage. And then from from this room, which is where the, the bar and the kitchen is in the living room area, you can go to the galley that way, or I mean the helm, or you can get to the helm that way. And then I'm just going to take this way so you can see it. Come around to the front. Here's the helm. There's the bow of the boat. And you can go down into a room there. And then there's another door and then back to the room. There is a ladder, a very strong ladder that goes up. And so we're gonna go up. There are two davits on each side. This is a dinghy, a bad dinghy. is actually in good shape. Um, no rips, I looked at it, no tears. Yeah. I was kind of surprised. Um, but the aluminum has got to be treated or it's gone. Because it's looking not good. And then all the all the in glass um, needs to be replaced. You see this bolt rope here, drive, see bridge. Helm station. So, get a glimpse. The uh, thrusters are also up here. They said they're just worthless for whatever reason. Once we'll find out why they're worthless, um, and they don't use them because it's so maneuverable because of the three inches. So that's it. When you come down here, you get to the master, tons of closet space. Uh, there's some underneath there, there's some equipment um, and tons of closet space there, tons of closet space there, a side table there, big, big bed there. 
another side table over there. Big chest of drawers there. But here's the steps we just came down. There's another set of drawers there. Then right here is the master bath. So when you come down the stairs, you got closets everywhere. And then a bathroom and then another chest of drawers right behind the door. The bathroom is jacuzzi tub. It's got a window that's open. That's why you hear all the noise. And then there's uh, your head there. And then for the for, for the master, all this is the master. Um, I'm gonna have to look it up with all this stuff later. Like a little looks like well, maybe when you put a baby or something and a maybe wash your hair those little knobs are everywhere but i think they're all going to be discontinued and then you walk through here you got it goes right into this is in the bow of the boat so you have some bunk beds here and they're on this bunk bed area has its own shower closet head I don't know if I have a light here there we go so when you walk in it's got its own head and shower unit lots and lots and lots of closet space you can't miss okay this stairwell remember we came through the master bedroom stairwell but there's a locked door right here where you can separate these two cabins this stairwell goes this is the helm we just came up this area which completely closes off this uh, little side window is all fogged up it'll need to be replaced that's the front and we're giving a real good view of all the controls you have two spotlights that's what those were there's your uh, compass radios and there's your three controls for your three engines that's your generator starters right there one for your starboard one for your port this is your um, bow thruster that he said is ineffective I don't know about that, we'll have to see. And then radios. It's a Furuno Navnet NT Max. Okay, we'll put the cover back on it. And then this is all your alarms for your engine room and stuff bolt monitor this is a little cover here that covers support there's another panel down here it also has a sliding glass that goes over uh, this is probably his internet stuff there for when he's in port there's a window there and storage up here and another one down here it's a little vacuum in the way but and some more extinguishers there speaker there that's at the helm and this is one side down to the back that's into the galley and this is the other side and there's mr. John at the top there's a micro scan looks like it's just a CD player some lights switches I'm not sure what they are Temperature gauges, eight engine, I was supposed. Now, what do they say? Indoor, outdoor, and seawater.
Reinforced, looks like about every foot reinforced with angle iron, and it's like a sump uh, discharge right there. Something hydraulic there, and not sure what those vent lines are down there. Let's check that out. And then there's your there's a buoy and the chain in the motor for your windlass. And there's also, I have no clue what that is, but there's something underneath there. It looks like possibly a inverter and then a battery in here. And there's also a plug and the switch right here at the steps. Hello, is that Hello. Captain Tommy and John, Brother John, going to pick up our boat. Well, we're going to do a survey on it, and we're going to do a sea trial. It's supposed to take five hours for the sea trial, and uh, possibly get a dinghy. We're going to bring y'all along with us. We're taking it one step at a time, but we are heading from Lake Charles, Louisiana to Tampa, Florida. Come along with us. Bye. 275, coming in Tampa. We are in Tampa. And you can't see them now because it's over the horizon, the cars are in the way, but you can see the city of Tampa and the buildings in the background. There they are. I don't know if you can see them. But they're back there. So we're coming. Tampa Skyline. Coming in. Going to West Marine to pick up a part. All right, we want to thank Lord Jesus for getting us here safely. Yes. We are at West Marine Tampa, in Florida. Tampa, Florida. Welcome. Hey, these are the McCalls where our boat is going to be pulled out of the water. And look what just came out of the water. Monster. So we're going to be here tomorrow pulling the boat out of the water. I'll have a video of it. This is Viking Boat Works. Good morning. Well, it is 623 on Tuesday, um, April the 16th. 16th. That's right. And we are in Braden, Florida, right south of Tampa, where the boat is at the Reg Regatta Point Marina. And we're ready. We're really ready. So, uh, Say Maybe good not awake, but we're ready. Right. Say good morning, John. Good morning. Good morning. All right. So we're going to be, uh, we're early. Like I said, we're 630 and it doesn't start till 8. But the traffic's really bad over here. And we were, our hotel's quite a far, uh, quite a bit away from the boat. But we made it. And we just want to say uh, welcome aboard. Uh, we're excited. Again, we don't know what we're doing. This is our first time, as it's probably going to be your first time Enjoy one day the when, ride. when you're watching this video. All right, we'll uh, we'll get back with y'all soon. Sunrise, April 16th, Regatta Point Marina. Yeah, this is good. Okay, we're going down the channel to 
to invite you. Okay, she's coming out of the water. We got her into the slip. Didn't get a lot of video because there was just a lot to do. And we're at Biking Boat Works. We're about to pull her out of the water. 